Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're well. I'm going to show you an old magazine that I have using some a download that did not come with the magazine, but I found it on the website and I downloaded it for free. And using the um the paper was my inspiration of my old magazine and using them back again making some cards. But before I get started, I would like to welcome back Carol Ann to YouTube, um, Crash Crafts. If you don't know her, please pop over. I will leave her description box down below, but welcome back, honey. It was nice to see you. Um, so the magazine, I'm just getting hold of it. Um... This was the magazine. Give me a second, guys. Okay. Um, it's quite an old magazine. But the papers that I found when I was downloading other pieces of papers and stuff from other magazines inspired me to use this magazine again. It's issue 190. And the free gift that came with it, well, actually a couple free gifts, as it goes, was, um, I've been using it a bit today. I need to get a CD cover, case, whatever. These uh, stamps, I won't show you fully. And it came with these dies to make the um, dream catcher. Now you saw me way back using this uh, magazine, but I've now got a, a stamp platform thingy magic, and I couldn't really use the stamps very well. Um, so that was that, and now I can because they come out a lot better. And I printed off some paper that goes really, really well from the mag um the downloads so here is the first card now i stamped this and the dreams and this bit here that's quite nice and these two pieces was the free download for a different magazine and they just look very lovely together and this black background paper so that's the first one um, they should have really put this paper with this actually because it goes really really well I stamped all these flowers and leaves in black I was going to do colours but since it's on a very colourful background um, I had these feather and this uh, arrows paper stuck together because I photocopied them together so I didn't have to use two different papers and actually I have some more like leaf effect paper and I might make some more using the free gifts out of that magazine so you might see another um, step to this and it's going back from different magazines and seeing what you can continue making uh, this is the third card um, I use the dream catcher die to do these I use a normal kind of cheap piece of paper uh, scraps uh, like to use up some scraps this was another piece of paper that I downloaded and that was a stamp of the dreams and that's how it turned out these are more flatter this has a little bit of dimension but because some cards that um, you want to send off normal first class and you don't want dimension because uh, you you might be a bit more money. I've been making more flatter cards. And this is the last card. It's a very small one. These are the bits of scrap left. And with the die, um, when it cut out the feather, these were the shapes afterwards. Um, do I still have the feathers next to me? Yeah, I do. So that's the feathers and that's what they come out. And that was the circle, um, not circle, the kind of rectangle box it was in. 
and I raised the centre bit and it's ripped and I thought that looked kind of sweet as well so those are four cards from reusing some old magazines and if you like me to do more of this and if you've got that magazine um then you can definitely have a go and I downloaded these free papers and then I'm going to do another video of a paper bag I believe it was from the works using the stamps and the die with that paper pad just in case you don't have this magazine because I don't think you can still buy it now you might be able to buy it offline anyways so that's my video today I hope you're enjoying the sunshine and keeping um, cool and not getting too much sun um, and yeah I hope you all have a lovely day thank you all for watching